If you already know Outlook 2003 or 2007 and want to get up to speed fast with Outlook 2013, you're in the right place. When you open Outlook 2013 for the first time, you'll notice some changes. First, there's a ribbon where the menu bar used to be. All your favorite commands are still there, but now they're easier to get to. For example, you can click here to start a new email message. And then use the ribbon in the message to do things like insert a table or a hyperlink. And click the Review tab to check spelling. Look what happens now when you click File. This is the backstage where you go to work with email accounts and data files. It's also where you go to set up automatic replies when you're out of the office. And where you go to manage options, like for example your signatures. When you open a message, there's a different backstage. And this is where you go to do things like print, and most importantly, recall a message you wish you hadn't sent. The new Outlook interface is designed for speed. With one click, you can select a message here and see it over here. Then with a second click, you can reply to it. Write your reply in the reading pane, or pop it out to another window. If the default layout isn't to your liking, you can personalize it. First, you can modify your space by collapsing or expanding panes. Hover over a tab to take a peek. Then click the pin to add it to your workspace. And click the X to remove it. For more options, go to the View tab. Here you can change your message preview or turn off the reading pane. You'll find the same kinds of options in Calendar, People, and Tasks. One more thing. You may have noticed that people are more prominent. Just hold your mouse over a name and a toolbar pops up with more options. Right click a name to add someone to your Outlook contacts. The contacts area is now called People, with a whole new way to look at contact information. So we've just shown you a quick overview of what's changed. Now let's go into more detail. Up next, Get a first in-depth look at Outlook 2013. Let's get started.